Bonjour. Voilà la conclusion de notre histoire, What Have You Had, Animal Teeth. When we last read, we were on the hippopotam, the hippopotamus. Hippopotamus. Hippopotamus's front teeth are long, strong pegs with very sharp edges. They're powerful weapons, so opening wide to show them off helps hippos scare away their enemies and the males to win a mate. Fact. Because a hippo's teeth don't yellow over time, in the past they were made into dentures. So some people used to eat with hippo teeth, including the first U.S. President George Washington. If you had hippopotamus front teeth, you'd never need to brush. Your upper teeth would grind against your lower ones, keeping them clean and white. Bengal Tiger a Bengal tiger's front teeth are a biting six-pack, four sharp pegs edged by twin pointed cones set between its giant dagger-like canines. They're perfect for scraping feathers off birds and meat off bones. Fact, a mother tiger uses her front teeth to bite very gently as she picks up and moves her cubs. If you had tiger teeth, if you had Bengal tiger front teeth, they'd be strongly anchored in your jaw. You could bite and hold tight while dragging something as heavy as five times your weight. Crocodile. A crocodile's front teeth are all shaped like cones and have sharp tips. They bite well but come out easily so new ones grow in very slowly. So a crocodile's front teeth are always changing and are often different sizes. Fact. Crocodiles can't clean their own teeth. They open up their mouths for small birds called plovers to pick leftover food off their teeth. If you had crocodile front teeth, your teeth would stick out when you closed your mouth. You wouldn't need to open wide when you went to the dentist or to give a toothy grin. Camel. A young camel's front teeth are very strong, long, and have very sharp edges. They're just right for nipping off tough, thorny desert plants. Fact, baby camel's front teeth erupt through their gums and by the time they're 14 days old. Like you, camels have two sets of teeth. Camels get their adult front teeth when they're about five years old. If you had camel front teeth and eight tough stuff eight hours a day as camels do, by the time you were grown up, your front teeth would be no more than stubs. Animal teeth could be cool for a while, but you don't use your front teeth to cut down trees or scare off enemies. You don't need them to dig tunnels or to bite really tough stuff. And you never lift the family car with your teeth even for fun. So what kind of front teeth are right for you? Luckily, you don't have to choose. The teeth that replace those that you lost will be people teeth. They'll be what you need to bite apples, carrots, and corn on the cob. Just what you need to help you talk and best of all to show off when you smile. Where do teeth come from? Adult teeth start growing inside your jawbone soon after you're born, even while your baby teeth are getting ready to push through your gums. Any new growing teeth are called tooth buds. The crown or top of the tooth forms first. Then the roots grow and push the tooth out. When this happens, an adult tooth, it makes the baby's tooth roots break down. Next, the baby tooth gets loose and falls out. Then the permanent adult tooth moves into this space. Teeth, would ca teeth need care. Besides two front teeth, you'll get 30 more permanent teeth, but you only get one set, so they must last your whole life. So brush at least both morning and night and floss between teeth regularly. Avoid fizzy drinks and sugary foods. Those help bacteria to grow. Then bacteria attack your teeth and cause tooth decay. Dentists and doctors have found there is a strong connection between having healthy teeth and a healthy body. So taking good care of your teeth can help you grow up feeling like you have something to smile about, 
Plus, you'll have a beautiful smile that lasts a lifetime. Et ça, c'est la fête.